It was just another Friday night for Zara Adil. She's the one behind the cash register checking out customers. But then you see two men walk in slowly. They have masks on and their heads are down. One walks up from behind and demands cash. He has a gun. Adil listens and opens up the cash register. The man scrambles to get the cash out, but then you notice he sets his gun down, giving Adil an opportunity to take control. So I picked up the gun and I pointed it to the second guy, run or else I'm going to uh, shoot you. He leaves his partner in crime behind. Now it's just Adil and the other man. He attacks her. The two wrestle. Adil says she shoots the man in the shoulder. He's now begging for his life. And I asked him why he's doing this. He was just like, let me go, let me go. The 21-year-old told the man she would let him go if he promised to leave the money alone. But as you can see, he goes right for it. That's his mistake. He went, he broke the deal we had. And you go after him. Yep. The man takes the drawer full of money and heads for the door, but not without a fight. Adele grabs the man and the two tangle up. The man eventually gets away, but without the money. Adil says there's a reason for what police call a robbery spree in Lexington. It's because nobody's fighting back. But not at her store. For standing up for what's right. And if everyone would stand up, she says. They won't have that much courage to go around and do what they're doing. In Lexington, Amber Kriska, ABC 36 News.